Previously on Game Trip. Something, because PP up is good. PP down is usually what you want. That's that's when it goes in the toilet. <laughs> that it doesn't have to be God. It could be, you know, uh, Mocule, the space, you know, sc scrubbler. <laughs> I'm gonna join. I'm gonna join Team Rocket. I'm in. Get, <clears throat> get me a uniform. Dancing on the graves and dancing with the ladies, dancing on the graves and we're dancing. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to Game Trip. This is episode 16, I think. We're pretty far in now. Um, but, you know, we've come across a lot of roadblocks, and uh, I just want to thank this guard for not being one of them. You know, he's just got some helpful advice for renaming Pokemon. Whereas all these other guards are sitting here demanding water or they're not going to let me through. Or maybe he's got the water. Maybe he's got like a supply, but he's not going to give it to me. Anyway, uh, we're going to we're gonna keep going and... Uh, oh, God. Yeah, this. Would you look at this asshole? He's just sitting here, taking up the whole road. And we got to get through. But you know what? I got the Pokemon flute. I, I got the Pokemon flute. Here it is. Uh, there it is. Wake up. It's time to wake up, Snorlax. After sleeping for some months in the middle of the road where everyone has to cross at some point. Come on. In a grumpy rage? I didn't think Snorlax was capable of that. Oh, yeah. That's satisfying. I don't know why, I like a big Pokemon. You know, just a big, giant one. Oh, look, I, I leveled up uh, Qualiger off-screen for a bit, because... Oh, right, we gotta deal with the rest. But now he's asleep, so he's not gonna rest for a while. I'm gonna catch him. I don't... I never let Snorlax go. One time I used the... the actually, that was the first time I played Pokemon. I used the Master Ball on Snorlax? No, you don't even get the Master Ball till later. I swear I used it in some game on Snorlax, and I really regretted it. Oh, he just keeps resting. Okay. Well, we're gonna fix this up with Wormulus. Because while we're not gonna level Wormulus, Wormulus up that much anymore, I can just paralyze this guy. Oh shit, that was the wrong one. Well, maybe that's a good thing. How about Stun Spore too? We'll just keep piling on, piling it on him, make him go back to sleep. <laughs> he just lays there, paralyzed. He can't move. We've we've buried ourselves in another hole. Um, now who's gonna do this? Who's gonna lay the smack down on this guy? Let's do Lord Love, because he's quite powerful. Just like always, Charizard's my best Pokemon. I do that on purpose, though, or subconsciously at this point. its He's my favorite. I can't help it. I love you, Charizard. You're the best. Ooh, okay, we can't do that too much. <laughs> okay, perfect. He can't move. He's paralyzed. Let's catch this jerk. Uh, I brought balls. I didn't bring that many balls. I thought I bought a bunch of them, but I, I guess I didn't. Oh, he's caught. He's done. <laughs> he's essentially in a comatose state at this point, so... We'll eat anything, even if the food happens to be a little moldy. It never gets an upst upset stomach. Oh, that's totally me. You know what? We'll just name him, uh... Ooper. No, but that's all caps. We gotta go. We gotta make it right. And then we will put him away in the box, never to be used again. Bye, Snorlax. Sorry for all the sniffling. I I am in the midst of strep throat. And it's it's been a doozy. Um, but I gotta keep producing the content, and I ran out, so 
you know, this is almost a live recording. You're getting this as at the day that it's being made. I planned on having a whole bunch of backup content, but it it just, I, I got COVID and that wiped out like two weeks of content. And uh, now I have strep, which has really been pushing me to just have to make a whole bunch more. But that's not a bad thing. You know, um, I like doing the stuff, but it, it's hard when I have no energy or when I have a crippling headache or a throat or I can't talk. I made some tea, but I stupidly put it too far away and now I can't reach it. But I'll get it eventually. Anyway, great that we're past that now. I'm so excited, like half the game's opened up to us now because we, we ended Snorlax's reign. Oh, you know what? We're confused. Qualiger doesn't get confused. Qualiger confuses you, Shelter. But, uh, yeah, it's been a doozy. I've never been this sick this many times in a row in my life for this long. I usually kick it the next day. The If I get a flu or something, you know, it's I get a little bit feverish and then I'm okay, but... This year has really done it to me, which, I don't know, maybe it's because I chopped open my leg and my immune system's not great. Oh, here's a sneeze. It's coming. Oh, it's stuck. It's stuck. <laughs> Whoa. Hope that wasn't too loud. Whoa. Oh. But the show must go on, right? So, here we are. We're playing Pokemon Yellow. We're like halfway done. Unless you count the Elite Four. And, I don't, I don't know. There's nothing here? Really? Nothing. Huh. All these little empty spaces. Hey you, gotcha. <laughs> the fishing fool. Versus some kid. I'd like a better nickname. I thought I wanted a nickname, you know, when I was 12. Like, it would give me some street cred. Um, but I don't think it would have. And, uh... Most people didn't know my regular name anyway, so... But, you know, that's what happens when you go to a, a big 5A school with, like, I don't know, thousands of kids. You kind of just get lost in the sauce. Hell, I would see brand new people, like, every day. Woohoo! You know what? These are all water Pokemon. Let's give Pikachu a front a front seat for once. Instead of just tagging by my side, riding around on my bike. Be patient. Fishing is a waiting game. Not for me. I put my rod in there and I, I usually get something within like five seconds. Not... yeah. <laughs> okay. Two tentacles, that's not much. Oh man, I really enjoyed the the Pokemon episode with Tentacool in it. They they made Tentacool into essentially like these evil not evil, they weren't evil, they were just pissed. You know? They were a pissed off environment, so don't piss off your environment. But they were uh what do you call them? They're from Dungeons and Dragons, they're uh tentacle head guys. Why can't I remember? You know, Cthulhu people. Uh, but they, the mind flayers. Mind flayers. They pop one on your head and then you have yourself a good old brain slug. So Tentacle can do that, apparently. Just mind control people. And I think that's freaking awesome. All the little references they, they threw in, like, you know, Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee being Bruce Lee and, and uh, Jackie Chan. Ugh. Sniffles. Good job, Pikachu. You're not even going to die this episode. Just a little wag. Ugh. 
Yeah, sick. Sure, send out your Goldeen. And these guys, when are they gonna start sending me the, uh, you know, the Sea Kings? And the Seedras and the crazy stuff? Probably never. I don't think the regular trainers really give you that much to, to, to fight against, really. Which is part of the reason they made so many ROM hacks for Pokemon. I mean, part of it. The other part was, like, just the in a... This looks like it... What is this, just a bridge to a wall? Insanity. Oh, God, is this gonna be one of those thirsty guys? Oh, a lookout spot. That's cool. What are we gonna see? Looked into the binoculars. It's Pokemon Tower. What about these? A man fishing. How exciting. Oh, whoa. Um, I'm sorry for your loss, but I will take that TM happily and greedily. Swift. Oh, yeah, that's a... That's a weird move. That's a weird move. Maybe Pikachu needs Swift. But Qualgar would make the best use of it. Well, Slam wasn't really doing me any good, so Pikachu gets it. There's gotta be a way to see what your moves do in this one. Hi, Pikachu. Oh, that was cute. Cool, what do they do? No one knows. No one knows what the Pokemon moves do. How did we figure that out back in the day? Uh, I came from that way, I think. So we're going this way. Oh, wait, Lavender Town? Well, it might be worth... You know, we're getting on the bike again. It might be worth retracing the route. Just because I'm coming from a different direction, who knows? Oh no, it's just Lavender Town. Again. Okay, so there's no reason to do that. Whatever. We will keep going. Oh man, uh, I'm starting to congest. And what, we're, we're 12 minutes in, whatever. I can do this. I don't need to blow my nose like a fool. But I can I can grab my tea. Ooh, it's too hot. Tea takes forever to cool down. Oh, just a rando. Use your new move. Yeah, that didn't do much. But we'll keep it we'll keep it going because it looks cool. Little stars. Bye, Voltorb. I hope you uh, figure out what's wrong with you. Yeah, let's bring out... Uh, well... Yeah, Lord Love. Or, I mean, Qualiger. I'm sorry, Lord Love. <laughs> Look at him! <laughs> He's the biggest teeth I've ever seen. He doesn't look as... Oh, shit. Thanks for taking the hit, Qualiger, for Pikachu, so she didn't have to die this episode. <laughs> oh, he's a rocker. Because he... Oh, he has a microphone. I think I figured that out earlier, but it looks like a whip. Because it just... It just abruptly ends. I'm the fishing guru's brother. I simply love fishing. Do you like to fish? Grand, I like your style. Fishing. Take this fish, young one. Oh, uh, fishing rod. I thought he gave me a fish. Okay, now I have the super rod, which means I can... I can catch something. Let's just see. Let's see what we get, because... I was trying out the old rod, and it was just giving me, like, magic harps at level 5. Well, some rod. I'm just gonna throw it in the river. Nothing? 
What a piece of crap. This guy was trying to give me the skits. Oh, maybe that's the wrong spot. No? That... I ought to go back in there and throw this rod on the ground. I'll leave a bad re review on Yelp. Okay, here we go. It doesn't catch often, but it catches... Holy shit, it's just a full Seedra. That's cool. It's fodder for you, Pikachu. Enjoy it. A whole Seedra, that's sick. I think Seedra's... It's definitely in my top ten of this generation. It's a cool Pokemon. It, it, I don't know, you can you kind of look at a Pokemon and you, you're like, oh yeah, that's uh, You know... You almost know how it's going to perform. I don't. I'm a terrible Pokemon trainer, but Seedra seems like it would do good. Now look, a guy who needs a good cut. He's just trapped in there. All for you. You never know what you could catch. And let me guess, uh, you're a rocker? No, he's a fisherman. <laughs> oh man, you must have the old rod. You gotta go get the good the good rod you just, from the old man. You just gotta tell him that you like fishing and he'll give you free crap. Catch yourself a Seedra. Another Magikarp. I think this guy knows what he's going to catch. I think he was just full of shit ju just then. Lost it! That was not a good line. Oh, look, and you made the tree grow back with your weird fishing powers. Good. They're giving me too many special items. I can't, uh, I can't hold on to all this stuff. Let's see what needs to go. We're not gonna... I just feel so weird tossing a Moonstone away. Here, we'll use PP up. Um, I don't know. Here, Danny, you got a good move that you're gonna keep forever? No? Double Edge. We'll probably keep that one. Just, I don't know, it's got some... It's got some... Oh, more. Okay, well, we'll give the Iron... Some Iron Supplements... And that's defense. So who's a good defense Pokemon? Well, it's got to be Danny Jr. I'm never going to max out these EVs anyway. I don't I don't think I will. I'm not sure how long it takes. But it's, it's hundreds of battles for sure, which I don't know if I have time for because I have to play all the video games. And yes, I have a Moonstone. Do you want it? I'm never going to use it, buddy. And neither are you. Oh, he's probably got a little Clefairy. No, no, it's a Nidoran. You don't need a Moonstone to evolve Nidorino, do you? <laughs> Nidorino. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff Arino. You can you call anyone a Reno, but he's a Rhino. Oh, it's a Rhino. I'm I'm dumb. Do you need a Moonstone? I think you do, actually, to evolve th that family of, of guys. Oh no, Pikachu! Oh, you uh, that was my fault. I wasn't watching. I guess it wouldn't be the same if you didn't die at least once. I'm a terrible trainer. There we go. Okay, well, they're dead now. Um, let us level up Danny. Because we want Danny to evolve. Because that'll be super cool. Because Blastoise is cool. Not as cool as Charizard. And that might be a controversial, a controversial opinion. But it's mine. And I'm not saying it's true, but that's what I think. I can't leave him dead. If I have revives, I can't just leave them dead. I know it makes more sense to just go to the Pokemon Center.
Let's see. Okay. Here's a pile of grass. Is there some kind of weird Pokemon in it? Because there's there's nothing here. Oh, no, no. I'm not doing this again. I told myself I wouldn't do that. Well, let's just see what Pokemon's in here. Because it's a weird... It's a weird bush patch in the middle of nowhere. Oh, it's Oddish. It's Oddish. That little asshole. Get out of here. Submission. Oh, no. That's what I get. I just get poisoned. Uh, I got scared away by an Oddish. And I don't have an a a antidote. I know I don't, so... Here we go again with the... The blinking screen. It's always been a little pet peeve of mine. I don't like effects that just... Blink your whole screen like that. Or the Zelda hearts that just beep when you're almost out of them. That... It, I mean, come on, you... You're just... You're walking around. And, uh... Oh, God. Another sneeze. Nope, no, it's gone. You're just walking around in Zelda, and everything's mystical and magical and musically attuned. And then you got this... This... Just... Factory-like beeping noise that comes out. It's insanity. Oh, Danny Jr., why did I put you in the front? I knew what kind of people I was fighting. Okay, so... That makes sense. Fighting moves aren't good against uh, against grass types because the, the submission didn't work against Oddish, and that's one I have completely forgotten. Kind of like how I could have someone pointed this. Oh shit! It's the six six six. I don't I don't care. Someone put the uh, in the comments that I could have used Mankey to beat Brock. And I just, that just blew over my head. And of course, Minky's a, a fighting type because of Primate and his little, you know, his boxing hands. I, I thought they were gloves for a long time, but no, he just has really weird shaped glove, glove shaped hands. Uh oh. Yeah, you know, th there it is. There's that beeping noise. It went into my subconscious and I completely ignored it because I've heard it a billion times. It's not even alarming anymore. Sick. Um... Well, I know I got a potion. Yeah, got lots of potions. Oh, it's... Wow, Danny Jr.'s got so much health, it's not really... It's not really doing the trick anymore. Okay, let's let's survey this. I'm on a bridge. These guys are going to keep using water Pokemon on me, so I just got to make my own life easier. I never really... I don't care how long a game takes most of the time, but, you know, I, I have been thinking that, like, wow, I've set myself up with this huge task of playing them all. And... Oh, I'm almost out of Thunderbolts. And it would... I'll get to do more of it if I play well. So, I mean, I'm not going to say I'm going to do good in every game. I barely beat G. Darius. I was saying earlier that that's the... That's like... That's the ceiling for my skill, skill level right there. And I don't think that's what's traditionally considered that difficult. But not that I care. But, yeah. So, whatever. You know, well, it, doing something like putting Pikachu against the water Pokemon. Instead of just blasting everybody with Charizard and War Turtle. Holy crap! Got enough Pokemon, lady? Oh, wrong move. Oops. Sorry, Pikachu. Ah, you, now the whole thing's going to be janked because of your sand attack. See? Oh, great. No, Pikachu! Swift never misses. 
that's what it is. Agility? Oh, that... Is that good? What do I have? Well, you know, I think double team's considered like one of those cheat moves in officially, so I'll try to stay away from those. Uh, yeah, let's get someone else out. Now Danny can come out. Because these are just a bunch of normal dudes. And Pidgey. Sorry, Pidgey, you're a flying type. Normal. A normie. Where did that term come from, the normie? That I've heard that. I mean, I get it. You know, it's so easy to relate to, right? If you're, Especially if you're, like, some kind of weirdo. But where did it come from? Is it, like, an old word? I, th I think I'd know about it. Or is it is it new? Did it come from that Weird Al movie? Because they kept saying that that trailer. You know, the one with uh, Daniel Radcliffe. Which I still haven't seen, which I'm super excited to see. Oh, God, and... Uh, the Super Mario movie came out or is it just the Mario Brothers movie? I don't know but it came out and it, it made more money than any animated movie I, I haven't checked the numbers really but that's that's what the news is telling me so don't take that for fact. Always check your numbers but yeah it, it made so much money I didn't think it would do that, that well you know but that generation is... I mean, Mario's in, like, every generation, so it's got the fan base. That's my plan. I'll just keep playing these for long enough until people just end up watching because it's been around so goddamn long. Whoa. Let's not do that again. Oh, twins. Twins, 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 twins. Do you want to Pokemon with me? I will Pokemon with you. I will Pokemon with you right now. I could never tell what these characters are. I could have sworn those were two young girls, and it's this, like, D. Snyder lady. Oh, right, right, Pikachu. You're you're out of the game, really. Um, ugh, everyone's kind of out of the game. No. Oh, not the slaps. This isn't gonna... Well, I got potions. I got potions. Wow, you are not good at hitting War Turtle. You gotta be careful. Oh, minimize. That's another cheap move. Oh, and she just stays that way. She's just tiny. Is she just waiting for me to die from the poison? Did her attack go down? Is that what minimize does? Because she looks like a, a tiny little Snorlax. No. Four times with the double slap? That's not double. That is not how double works. Two. Oh, each one's a double slap. So really, it's like, that was six slaps just now. Meowth. Meowth breaks the fourth wall a lot, which I think is really cool. You know, he's like the little call-out character. Like, I would watch a Pikachu and Meowth show. Because Pikachu's the best character, and, and Meowth, like, their Pokemon are way more interesting than the actual characters walking around. Well, she gave me a lot of money. Okay, let's let's heal these guys up again. Yeah, that ought to do it, right? Was not expecting that from you, D. Snyder. Oh, right. Damn it. <laughs> I keep forgetting we're out of pee pee. We got no pee pee in our bladder. Ah, 
that's good enough, though. Uh, yeah, I know what I'm gonna do. Oh, it's it's hard to want to kill Vulpix. Sneak attack. I gave Danny some iron. He's tough. You're gonna have to do more than that to take the wings off his little bald head. You know what I loved about the Game Boy... Oh, the episode's almost over. Am I going to start talking about the Game Boy Advance? We'll start talking about the Game Boy Advance next time. Because this is the end. It's been 30 minutes, so... We're on our way to... To Silence Bridge. Whatever the hell that is. Anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe uh, if you want to. Or if you just want to, like, make me feel better. Just... If you enjoyed it, enjoy it some more. Because we're going to keep doing this pretty much forever. Forever. Forever for all time. Wow, 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 wow.